Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're interested in seeing what I made for this week, then just keep on watching. One of my sisters purchased these six flower wooden shaped pieces for me from Dollar General a while ago. And my other sister was just telling me that she wanted a marble coat rack. So that's what we are creating today. But first, I'm applying this white semi-gloss spray paint as a base coat. Since the wind was blowing a lot, it was kind of hard for me to spray paint. I don't know if you guys can see, but the shapes are not fully covered. So I'm using this acrylic paint in the color white. Since my sister said she wanted marble, I figured why not try the hydro dipping. I have a bucket here. I lined it with a trash bag, filled it with water, and now I'm using my black spray paint along with the white and also the metallic silver. All I'm doing is spraying each individual can of spray paint into the water one by one. So now I have a Q-tip and I'm just going to lightly place it in the water to kind of break up the spray paint a little bit to give it that marble effect look. Okay, now this first shape didn't really turn out the way that I wanted it to. As you guys can see, it barely covered the whole entire shape but I ended up re-dipping this off camera. Now for the second one, this one turned out exactly the way that I wanted it to and I did not change the water at all. As you guys continue to watch, you will see that it still turned out great. This is what my shapes are looking like now that everything is dry. This is the back versus the front. Now the shapes look good as is, but I wanted to add a little bit more detail. So I'm using 
my Mod Podge and I have this brush and I will be using these premium silver flakes that I got from Michaels and I also have a pair of tweezers. Now the only thing I'm doing is just placing the Mod Podge on anywhere on the shape that I think should have a little bit of sparkle and then I'm just going to lay the flakes on top of the Mod Podge and press it in. I'm going to wait until the Mod Podge dries a little bit, then I'm going to brush the excess flakes off. So now we're back outside and to seal everything on all of my shapes, I will be using this clear gloss spray paint. I'm going to glue these crystal drawer knobs on using my E6000 glue and then I will be right back to show you guys the finished look. I think this week's project turned out great especially by it being my first time hydro dipping and using the silver flakes. These can be used for coats, jackets, jewelry, keys, or whatever you desire. For those of you who are wondering, I hung these on the wall with command strips. Comment down below and let me know what y'all think. And feel free to share and subscribe and hit that notification bell if you're curious to see what else I can create.